There are several methods to assess the pain level. I would like to share all of you about pain assessment. For that, we must know what is pain. Pain is an unpleasant emotional and sensory experience. Two types of pain. One is acute, where the pain is occurs suddenly, and another is chronic pain, which is lasts longer period, example more than three months. We must assess the pain so that we can able to titrate the amount of analgesia or painkiller as the patient's level of pain and to achieve the best analgesia and release the side effects effects and also for the documentation purpose. Some characteristics of pain such as colicky pain, radiating pain, stabbing pain, rushing pain. There are several methods to assess the pain level such as numerating rating scale, visual analog scale, categorical scale or verbal scale and also we have methods for assess the children's or old age people, language barrier such as face scale and flat scale. Method that commonly used to assess the pain level. Numerical rating scale that we use for assess the pain in the adults which consists of from 0 to 10 where score 0 which is no pain patient can able to do activity daily living without any problem score 1 to 3 categorized as mild pain where the patient can able to tolerate and control the pain score 4 to 6 be categorized as a moderate pain where that's patient's activity daily living such as cannot eat, cannot sleep well. So it can able to reduce the pain by giving the low dose medication. Score 7 to 9 we categorize as a severe pain where the patient can't able to tolerate the pain and can be treated by giving high dose medications. And score 10 we categorize as a worse pain where can be treated by giving high dose medication. Example labor pain. Hopefully what I have have shared just now can give benefits to everyone okay like share and subscribe this channel